Hi guys, good day everybody and welcome to my YouTube channel, The Creative Nurse RM. For more information and updates about kumikitang kabuhayan, our small business ideas, and we have organic healthy tips and beauty tips, health and disease issue, and everyday life happenings. Today, we are going to talk about the uh, hindi siya masyadong napapansin na isang herb, wild herb or wild plant na makikita natin sa ating surroundings. Minsan tinatapak-tapakan natin or minsan di natin na alam na this is beneficial and it has some good uses at saka important uses sa ating katawan. So, we are talking about the importance and the benefits of this plant, wild plant, which is the dandelion plant, herb plant, a dandelion leaves. And this plant, you can use the leaves, you can use the roots, you can use the the bunga or the fruit and also the flowers mas lalo na ngayon if you want if you see this plant anywhere make it a habit na kunin niyo siya pwede niyo siyang kunin at saka padamihin put it in a pot and put it in your house and you can use it someday if you have some other sickness na ma, na masasabi ko mamaya na matutunan niyo mamaya ng mga sakit-sakit at saka mga benefits na makukuha niyo sa ganitong plant so uh, as we know that is health is wealth and also prevention is better than cure so kailangan natin na we have the nature diba god give us the nature and all the plants so that we can use it for our good health hindi lang sa mga medication kung hindi hindi na hindi pa na kaya pa na pwede pang i-prevent we can use our nature and also uh, we are going to tackle we are going to talk about this plant and please um watch subscribe on my channel so that you will learn something about anything about health beauty health in organic in nature and also some of the business ideas and so um for those people who did not subscribe yet please subscribe to my channel watch my channel and you will learn something beneficial to your health and if you want to comment comment down below so that you will i will read it and i will I will answer back and uh, I will answer back what is your question about your health anything so and uh, for the for those ones to have a member uh, to be a member of the creative nurse are and you can be a member join on my team so that we can talk about anything about your sickness I can give you advice I can give you uh, personal advice and anything like that so thank you very much and before anything else before we are going to uh, finish my talking <laughs> This is the dandelion leaves. You see this one? This is the dandelion leaves. Okay? So, please watch uh, this video and you'll learn something about dandelion leaves. So, thank you very much and have a nice day, everybody. Hi guys, good morning. We are here outside kasi maghahanap tayo ng dandelion herbs. Yung wild herbs na makikita natin kung saan-saan. Minsan inaapakan. Minsan, hindi natin alam na yun pala ay may benefits or beneficial to our health. At saka meron ang kanyang bulaklak at saka yung mga leaves at saka yung roots are all beneficial to our health. So, explain ko sa inyo or sa, um, for this uh, video, you will learn and you will know what is the importance of dandelions. Guys, ano, yan. Kita nyo yan? Yan. Yan siya ang dandelion, o. Oh. Yan. Kita mo yung dahon niya. Yan. Dito, ito yung tinatawag nating dandelion. Yan. Tumubo lang siya dyan. Gusto niya yung medyo may matubig-tubig na area. Ayan, o. Oh. So, this is the dandelion. Oh. Yan. Ito yung dahon niya. Sa Pinas, meron din ganito eh. Na ano. Na mga wild, wild herbs. Ayan. So, ito yung bulaklak niya. Kita niya yan. Yan. Ganda. Wala pa siya actually yung bunga. Pero, ito yan siya. Yan oh. Yan lang siya nakasiksik sa ano cemento. Gusto niyo yung may mga malamig-lamig. Yan. Yan. Yan yung dahon niya. Sa bulaklak ng dandelion. 
Tapos yung ipapakita ko rin sa inyo. Yan. Ito yung kanyang bunga. As you can see, yan. Yan yung kanyang bunga. Ikita nyo. Yan yung kanyang bunga. Tsaka ito yung kanyang bulaklak. Yan. So, nagbibidyo ako. Habang nagbibidyo ako, nandito si Ningning. Ayan, kinuha. Kinain mo. Puti! Puti. Hindi yan kinakain puti. Yan, kinakain niya. Kinain niya. Yan. Diba? Nakiki-exena si puti. Ayan, exena pa more puti. Puti, exena pa more. Powers natin ng dandelion at saka dandelion herbs. Dandelion plants. Dandelions derives its name from the French term dent de lion, meaning tooth of a lion. Though the dandelion has been carried from place to place since before written history, it can at least be said that the plant is native to Europe and Asia. On the 17th century, the dandelion was used for medicine, food, and also for wine. All parts of the plant can be eaten and are often found in the salads, roasted, fried, mixed in pancakes, or made into wine, tea, or coffee-like drink. Dandelions have a taste similar to chicory or indict with a bitter tins. Hi guys, good day everybody and uh, today we are going to uh, discuss or tackle about the benefits of dandelion. The picture ahead are the example of dandelion flower roots and also the plant itself. So what are the benefits of <coughs> sorry, <coughs> sorry, uh, dandelion leaves, leaves or plant? At saka, saan natin ito makikita ang dandelion? Dandelion. So, sa Philippines, I saw in the, kung saan-saan lang sa mga uh, street or sa mga forest, sa mga hal, mga damo-damo, yan. Tapos, nag insert lang siya doon, yun siyang dandelion. Pero, hindi natin lang kasi minsan alam na yun pala ay may benefits din. So, what is the dandelion? Dandelion is a kind of flower. It is uh, beneficial and highly nutritious plants loaded with vitamins, minerals, and fiber. So, dandelion, dandelion greens can be eaten, cook or raw, and serve as an excellent source of vitamin A, C, and K. They, they also contain vitamin E, folate, and small amounts of other vitamin B, B1. Vitamin B1. So, from the root to the flowers, the dandelion is a good source of these uh, vitamins, minerals that I already told you. And not only that uh, it is nutritious and from the roots to the flowers, it, you can use it for cooking, you can use it for salad, you can use it for making cookies, and you can use it for uh, this one, um, uh, the roots, you can use it for boiling and making as a tea. So, ganun yung use ng dandelions. Marami pala siyang use. Ngayon ko lang din siya actually nalaman. Nung makita ko kasi siya sa, uh, ano, sa Google. So, sinearch ko siya kung ano yung mga uses. At saka minsan mo lang siya nakikita talaga sa ating, ano, sa ating mga, sa mga, ano, bahay-bahay na, ay, ito palang plant na to is useful. So, ano pa yung ibang, uh, sorry, ano pa yung ibang mga benefits ng dandelion? When people talk about dandelion tea, they are largely talking about one of the two different beverages, an infusion made of the plant's leaves or one made of roasted dandelion roots. Both are considered safe as long as you haven't sprayed your yard with herbicides or pesticides and are used for a variety of purposes. So, yung dandelion, leaves, roots, or yung flower niya is magagamit natin for cooking, for tea, and also for boiling, yung mga ganun. So, first, we are going to discuss uh, how it will be useful or beneficial or important in our health kung gagawin natin siyang dandelion tea. So, we have dandelion tea. Uh, ginaga, ano na to nila? Ginagawa na nilang tea. At saka, yung ginagamit doon is either the plant's leaves or 
made of roasted dandelion roots. So, either roots or yung ginagawa natin or yung flower, or yung leaves niya. So, uh, pan, ano ang uses na maga, magagawa niya sa ating katawan if we are going to use it uh, as a tea? So, number one is it reduces water weight. So, if you're feeling bloated, dandelion tea could be provide relief because it acts as a diuretics and increases urine output. So, one study showed an increase of urine output, output after two one cup servings of dandelion tea made from the leaves of the plant. So, the number two, it can be, it could be promote liver health wow do diba maganda na naman siya sa ating liver so dandelion roots has long been held as a liver tonic in folk medicine so pre preliminary study suggests that this is due in part to its ability to increase the flow of bile so yun siya so uh, meron din siya effect na the dandelion root tea could help detoxify the liver, helps with skin and eye problems, and relieve symptoms of liver diseases. Wow! O diba ang galing niya? So, this, this as a 2017 study suggests that polysaccharides in dandelion may indeed be beneficial to liver function. Uh, magtatanim na pala ako ng dandelion sa Pinas. Gusto ko siya magtanim na uh, para meron akong ano... Uh, herbal medicine na organic di ba? Parang gusto ko na siyang itanim kasi maganda pa yung bulaklak niya tapos maganda pa yung ano niya beneficial pa siya sa health. So number 3, it can act as a natural coffee substitute o pwede din siyang as coffee substitute. Number 4 similarities between dandelion and a weight loss drug. So a recent Korean study daw suggests that dandelion could have similar effects on the body as the weight loss drug or listat which works by inhibiting pancreatic lipase and in enzyme release during digestion digestion to break down fats kasi yung bile natin yan siya ang nag-release ng abdo ba na nag-release ng bile para itunawin ang mga kinakain natin so yan din yung effect ng dandelion pag nag-inom ka nun, parang nag ano din siya uh, nagre-release din siya ng ano ng chemicals like pancreatic lipase enzyme an enzyme release during digestion to break down the fats wow ang ganda niya so parang gusto ko siyang ano gawing siyang plants sa ano pinas so maghanap na ako ng dandelion sa kung saan sa ang gilid ng bahay then uh, what else A dandelion tea may Soothe digestive, di digestive ailments. So, dandelion root tea can have many positive effects on your digestive digestive system. Although most of the evidence is an anecdotal, it has historic, hist historically been used to improve appetite, uh, soothe minor digestive ailments, and possibly relieve constipation wow o di ba ang ganda niya talaga parang ano siya uh, uh, talagang useful na useful siya sa atin so hindi mo na kailangan pang bumili ng mga kung ano ano mga gamot gamot or something like that uh, it's better na ano maghanap ka ng mga dandelion uh, plant herbs na mga wild herbs tapos gawin mo siyang ganito na pang inom gawin mo siya ah, gawin mo siyang Pwede din siyang gawing cookies or sa ilagay sa mga salad yung bulaklak niya. So, it could have future anti-cancer applicator applications din. So, ganun siya ang event. So, yung study na to, 2011 Canadian study showed that dandelion root extract it induces cell death in melanoma. Melanoma cells without impacting non-cancerous cells. Another showed that it does the same to pancreatic cancer cells. So, while the anti-cancer effects of dandelion tea haven't been tested, 
the potential is positive. Wow, di ba? Ang ganda. So, ano na siya? Maghanap na kayo ng dandelion leaf uh, plant. Tapos itanin nyo na sa bakuran nyo. So, marami pa siyang ibang effect. Uh, it may help also prevent urinary tract infections, possible side effects. May side effects din siya. Uh, dandelion is considered safe for most people. However, some people may have some allergy. So, yung sinasabi ko, pag may allergy, i-testing-testing muna kung may allergy ka. Huwag yung kainin kaagad-agad. Yun lang naman yung ano niya na baka may, yung ibang tao may, may, ano, may uh, allergy. So, ano pa ba yung iba? Ang dami no, ang ganda. Parang, ang ganda ng ano niya talaga. Ang ganda pa ng bulaklak niya. Tapos, maganda pa yung effect niya. Kung ano naman, kung sa mga leaf niya, sa yung sa kanyang dahon or leaf, so may meron din siyang ano, meron din siyang beneficial or benefits of uh, dandelion leaf. So it is contain potent antioxidant. Then may help fight inflammation, may aid blood sugar control. Wow. May reduce cholesterol. May lower blood pressure, may promote a healthy liver, and may aid weight loss. Yun siya yung effect ng, pag gaga, ang gagamitin mo is ang dahon, ang the leaf ng dandelion. So, kung pa, paano kaya yan gagamitin, sa sa ano kung maya, isa ano ko sa inyo, i, i, sasabihin ko sa inyo din, at saka sa, ano natin, i-discuss natin. So, kung gagamitin natin na naman yung kanyang flower, sa flower niya pala ganun din, uh, pwede din pala siyang gawing tea, tea flower be, uh, benefits. So, dandelion flower tea benefits. So, kung sa flower naman, it is an excellent source of potassium daw yung flower. A mineral and electrolyte that stimulates the heartbeat. Potassium may help the kidney filter toxins more effectively and imp improve blood flow. So, the polysaccharides in dandelions are known to reduce st stress on the liver and support its ability to produce bile. So, ginagawa rin pala siyang tea yung flower niya. So, yan yung mga gamit niya. Mayroon siya sa uh, roots can be also used as a, ano nga ba yun, yung, yung tea at saka yung dahon at saka yung flower niya. Pero yung flower niya, yung sabi ko kanina, ginagawa nila, hinahalo nila sa, ano, sa bread or sa mga cookies cookies yung ganun hindi ang sarap no di ba gagamitin naman natin ay dandelion root root tea so break the dan dandelion root in a mortar yung ano sa mortar until it is chunky and the size of lentil lentils dandelion root tea is a de decoction rather than an infusion you need to simmer the root in a pan on the stove in water for about 15 minutes. Oh, so, 15 minutes siya. Simmer mo siya. Allow the decoction to settle and then strain it into your cup. Ganon. So, mas kung gusto niyo mas maganda na lang yung, ano, yung leaves niya kasi madali lang siyang gawin, di ba? Kaysa sa roots, roots niya. So, ano naman, paano naman pag flower ang ano natin gagamitin? Ang gagamitin naman natin ay flower niya. Uh, the dandelion tea can be made by packing fresh flowers and leaves into a mason jar and pouring simmering water over them. Let the tea infuse until it's cool enough to drink, then strain. Yun lang. Yun lang siya. Madali lang siya yung flowers niya. Marami pang siyang uses. Marami pang pwedeng paggamitan ng flower niya. So, the flower, you can eat them fresh. Wow. Use them to make a tea or dry them for future use. If if drying, chop them up into smaller pieces then when fresh and then dry them. Use use the vibrant yellow flowers of the dandelion to make wine, to infuse vinegars, oils and honey or to make tea. So, yan siya. Ang dami niyang uses. My God. So, pag uwi ko sa Pinas talaga, gagawa na ako kung hahanap na akong dandelion. Tapos, itatanim ko siya. Lalagay ko sa mga pots para useful pala siya. So, gawin ko siyang tea minsan. O yung flower, isali mo siya sa salad-salad mo or something ganon. Or sa, uh, ano nga ba yan, sa cookies. Mga question din. 
tayo dito sa about dandelion no for example ang ang mga question niya is uh, what part of the dandelion is poisonous by poisonous ba yung mga ibang part ng dandelion so almost all parts of the dandelion are edible and nutritious or avoid the flower stems as they have a white sticky latex in them that has a bit of a laxative effect. So, yung stem, stems niya daw, i-avoid natin. So, doon lang tayo kukuha talaga sa flower niya talaga lang. Then, um, ano pa? Leaves can be eaten raw or as cooked greens. Flowers can be fried or turned into dandelion wine. Wow! ba? Diba? Dami talaga niyang uses. So, another question na, na niya ulit, can you eat the flower of the dandelion? Pwede mo bang kainin daw yung flower ng dandelion? So, ang, tan ang sagot niya, if raw dandelion leaves don't appeal to you, they can also be steamed or added to a stir fry or soup. Ay, sorry, soup. <laughs> soup. 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 Soup pala. Soup, which can make them taste less bitter. The flowers are sweet and crunchy and can be eaten as raw or breaded and fried or even used to make dandelion syrup or wine wow are then the uh, isa pang question niya are dandelions flowers are poisonous to humans consuming dandelion is generally very safe although some people may be allergic to the plant and patients with gallbladder conditions and gallstones uh, should talk to a doctor for before ingesting before ingesting it for the vast majority of people uh, dandelions are highly nutritious and beneficial of addition, addition to the diet so yun siya so yun siya guys ang ating mga uh, beneficial ang benefits na makukuha natin sa dandelion plant or wild herbs na dandelion. So, uh, umpisaan nyo na guys na mag, ano, mag, uh, ano nga, mga kulik-kulik ng mga bulaklak. Pag nagkulik kayo ng mga bulaklak, kulik nyo na lang yung mga edible, yung pwedeng ma, ma ano, magamit, at saka pwedeng makatulong sa inyo, sa health nyo, at saka sa, sa mga, kung pang pa-beauty-beauty nyo na mga, halaman, huwag na lang yung mga mahal na tapos wala namang silbi, yung mga ganun so yun siya guys, ang ating ano, lesson for today so, uh, thank you for listening to me, and thank you for watching my video about the dandelion leaves, the importance of it I hope that it can help you in some other ways, in some other people and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, The Creative Nurse RN, like, share, and hit the bell button and if you have some questions about your health, about the uh, organic healthy tips just tell me and comment down 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 below so that i can read all your comments and so the next topic after this dandelion the benefits of dandelion uh, the next topic that we have which is very common or it's not common in the philippines but it is used widely in the philippines in the barrios or in the province mga probinsya probinsya tsaka my experience ko rin to nung ako ay maliit pa and it is really uh, effective the banaba tree leaves that banaba tree the 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 importance or the benefits of a banaba leaves or banaba tree na ginagamit natin for UTI and it is really very very effective so next guys watch this uh, video my next video and thank you very much and i hope that you are in good health and always don't forget that health is wealth and always a reminder from the your creative nurse rn is better to be healthy to be beauty and to be wealthy bye bye have a nice day everyone